If he is serious, as I, and I will now repeat it, one on one, if he is serious in developing our churches, there is one church that was burnt down in 2007. Let him build that and say, sorry, apologize to the families that lost their lives, apologize to the entire uh, Christianity folk, because he has not even apologized. And we know people died. What reminds me and makes me very bitter when I see him cheating people, taking advantage of their position, their poverty levels. A child who was weeping and crying around, looking for his mother, who was wailing right in the, in the fire, was held and thrown back into the fire. Shame on you. I'm telling you, we have not forgotten. Kikuyus, those who are with you, they are there for your money. We always say, never bury the elephant with its tusks. They are just built, they are cheating you. After all, how many are they? That is the position of our community. We respect leaders, especially those who are brought home by His Excellency the President, because Kikuyus don't have any other leader. It is Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta. I repeat, Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta. And we respect, like uh, Right Honorable Raira Undinga, because were it not for Right Honorable Raira Undinga, this country was going to the dogs. So the hardship, for me I called it golden hardship, because it has brought peace, tranquility, and now Kenyans can move anywhere in the country. I can address this same press conference in Kisumu, in Trukan, anywhere, in Mombasa. Before, we had zones. So when uh, you find people fighting the hardship, they are not only sabotaging the person they are supposed to help and assist. So it's a very big pity. And I know, up to this point, it's only that the Uhuru hands are tied. He would have dropped this man a long time ago. The way uh, I, uh, no, a retired president, <laughs> Uh, Daniel Arab Moy, he had Saitoti, he had Karaja, he I, I don't know, that kind of thing. But now the constitution says they, they are like Siamese twins. He cannot, but we are there to tell him to resign. He can resign because the whole cannot sack him as per the constitution. So we, we understand what he's doing. He's campaigning and therefore Uhuru has no time to, even Raira, right honorable, 